This is the Akron News Now update. I'm Lindsay McCoy. It's game time. The eyes of the University of Akron will be on Cary, North Carolina Friday, where the Zips men's soccer team plays in the national semifinals tonight against the Tar Heels of North Carolina. It's the first time in 23 years that the Zips have played in the College Cup. And more news from the U of A. Rob Ionello was hired as the head coach for the Zips football team. Ionello gets a five-year contract. There were nine finalists in the final poll. Well, the excitement surrounding the Browns and Steelers game turned violent last night as a fire broke out at the VFW Hall on Copley Road. News Channel 5 reports that the party at the hall was for Steelers fans in the Akron area. Several party goers were taken to St. Thomas Hospital suffering from various injuries. Akron police are now questioning several individuals who were at that party. It's not known if any arrests were made. Akron firefighters were called to battle a blaze at Kenmore Cleaners in the 1900 block of Manchester Road last night. The blaze broke out at around 8 o'clock in the evening. The flames, which started in the wall, spread to the roof and caused $110,000 damage. The Beacon Journal reports the cause of the fire is still under investigation. No one was hurt. And an argument inside the vertical nightclub led to gunfire moments later. Action 19 News reports that the dispute went outdoors where shots were Fired. Now four people were taken to local hospitals for treatment. There's no word on how many people were actually shot in the incident. So police are still searching for the suspects involved in a bank robbery that happened earlier this week at the National City Bank on Graham Road. These are a few of the new images from the surveillance cameras where the incident took place. Anyone with information that could lead to the arrest of the suspects is asked to contact Stowe Police. Well, as we take a look at our local forecast, breezy conditions today, mostly sunny skies, wind chills as low as below 3 degrees. So it'll be a little bit chilly uh, today and into this evening, just a low of 14 degrees. As we get into our weekend, a high of 36 degrees, mostly sunny skies. Saturday night, it will dip into the low 20s, and then Sunday, we have a chance for freezing rain. So kind of an up and down weekend as we get into next week. Partly sunny skies on Monday, high of 46 degrees. Tuesday, a chance for the rain and snow mix comes back. Continue to follow AkronNewsNow.com for the latest local news for news online on demand now. For Akron News Now, I'm Lindsay McCoy.